The Methods of Ethnology by Franz Boas was published in 1887. The book outlines the methods and principles of ethnology, providing a framework for conducting ethnographic research and understanding human cultures. Boas emphasizes the importance of empirical observation, cultural relativism, and the need for a holistic approach to studying societies. Boas begins by introducing the fundamental principles of ethnology, emphasizing the significance of empirical research and first-hand observation. He argues that ethnographers should engage in fieldwork, immersing themselves in the cultural context they study gain a comprehensive understanding of a society's beliefs, practices, and social organization. Boas promotes the use of participant observation, interviews, and collecting material artifacts as means to gather data. The book highlights the importance of cultural relativism, a concept central to Boas' work. He argues that every society should be understood and evaluated based on its own cultural norms and values, rather than being judged against the standards of another culture. Boas criticizes the ethnocentric approach prevalent in his time and urges ethnographers to appreciate the uniqueness and diversity of human cultures. Boas also explores the idea of cultural diffusion and the interconnectedness of cultures. He argues that cultural elements, such as technology, language, and religious beliefs, can be transmitted and shared among different societies through interaction and contact. Boas emphasizes the need to trace the historical origins and movements of cultural traits to understand their distribution and variation. Another aspect addressed in the book is the influence of environment on human culture. Boas acknowledges the impact of geographic, climatic, and ecological factors on shaping cultural practices and adaptations. He emphasizes the need to study how societies adapt to their specific environments, and how these adaptations influence their cultural expressions. Furthermore, Boas discusses the importance of linguistics in ethnology. He argues that language is a vital component of culture, and reflects the unique worldview and social organization of a society. Boas advocates for linguistic analysis to uncover the underlying structures and meanings embedded in language, and to understand the relationship between language and culture. Boas concludes by stressing the necessity of a holistic approach to studying societies. He argues that cultural phenomena are interconnected and should be examined in their entirety, rather than in isolation. Boas encourages ethnographers to consider the historical, social, economic, and environmental factors that shape a culture, emphasizing the complexity and interconnectedness of human societies.